Hello everyone and lecturers. So today I'm the presenter. My name is Hill Kwan Ching. I'm going to present about my projects, FinTech. So uh, you must ask me why, what is FinTech? So uh, before I started, I want to give you guys uh, ideas. Like, you know, a uh, taxi. And when we add technology inside, what we will call, we will call it Uber. And when we're hungry, we want eating, right? And we want someone to deliver for us and more convenience, right? So when Uber plus the eat, what we call, we call it Uber Eats. So actually, for FinTech, actually, the same ideas like what I'm giving you the examples. As you can see from the pictures that below, the finance and the technologies, it's become what? It becomes FinTech. So what is FinTech? Actually, FinTech is a technology for banking and corporation finance, capital market, finance data analysis, payments, and personal finance management. So FinTech actually is basically uh, companies that apply technology to fulfill the finance management needed of the consumers. So FinTech is able to compete with the traditional banks and finance institute, like, or like the, the microfinance houses, banks. Why? Why they can co comply with them? Because they offer the more efficiency solutions and given the customer a better experience to address their existing financial needs. So you can see the fintech was involves so many sectors like you can see the fintech universes is involved in the payments digital bankings investment crowdfunding p2p lendings blockchains insurtechs retakes so you can see involves so many technology and affecting our daily life now so i will like to explain and give an example in the payments so you can see so many uh, digital uh, payment now say PayPal, Apple Pay, Alipay in the China, and WeChat Pay also in China, like Samsung Pay. So I would like to share my most favorite is the Samsung Pay. Okay, so it's just take three simple steps, just simple step, you know. You can and then you can pay everything uh, for the payments. So first thing you just sweep up to launch the Samsung Pay, and then you just automate things with your fingerprints or the password pins, and and then you just tap your phone on the terminal to pay to make your payments. So it very easy, right? You no need to take out your wallet, take out the card, even or maybe more difficult, more tra traditional is you need to take out the wallet and give the cash to the counters and then they will uh, giving you the chance, right? Like charge you 22.50 cent and you pay for $50 and you need to giving you the chance. But now say by FinTech, no need. So what's the conclusion for FinTech traces? It's make us more convenient. And you don't need to bring a card or cash. It's make you a difficulty. And then you just, what you can see is fast. Save your time, right? You don't need to queue so long time for waiting for payments. Just need a tap, only three seconds. And then done all everything. For example, like now say in the, you know, the, petrol stations, uh, for example, the Petronas, they also are doing a uh, very quite convenient apps like Settle. You no need to wait at the counter for pay, paying the, the for, for the petrol. You just buy Settle and then you just tap, tap, and then you can start uh, fulfill your, your petrol, right? So same thing, by FinTech is totally uh, save our time and make us more convenient. 
and then you can see that banking is necessary, but banks are not. What that means is actually we still need banking, like for doing the payments, checking your account, and manage your savings, right? And do the loan management. But banks are not, which means that we actually now say we don't need to walk to the banks and do withdraw or do saving or everything or do any transfer. So we still need the banking, but we are better now. Like first thing, you can do the money deposit, withdraw and transfer. You can check or saving account management, apply for finance product, loan management, bill pays, or any account services. Like in before traditional, what do you need to do? Like deposit, you need to bring a lot of cash and go to the counter, deposit money. Or queue wait so long for widow money. Or even you need to bring the bank books to print and check your saving account. For finance or loan management, you need to bring a lot of documents and for appliance. But now, you know it by using fintech you just need to check in the scoring uh, and then you should when knows uh, how many loans you can apply and you can know your account your document everything now you know they bring so many and queue for waiting a word say oh you feel for doing the loan right so we still need banking but the fintech make it better saving time fast save your money right and then for digital well management evolutions what's the best thing in such here is you know human beings they have emotional they are affecting by surrounding environments or maybe the peoples if they're angry they maybe were given wrong direction wrong advices right but the fintech they were checking your online portfolio management and giving the management solution and that aim to invest the client access by automating the client devices. For example, we got for better means moving hood. And uh, beside the picture, finger shows that from their, their evolutions from 1.0 until 4.0. So you can see the big difference, like 1.0 there need to do calling, online questionnaire, uh, product or portfolio processes, listen to listed uh, ETF, bond shares, and then second is a uh, deduct fund management, manage adjustment and replace the balancing and fund of the funds, uh, portfolio views, risk-based portfolio and they are allocated. And triple is an uh, algorithm-based adjustment and rebalancing purposes. We defines an uh, investment rule sets. And a 4.0, the latest one is a fully automated invest and the, the robot advisor can sell learnings, machine learnings, algorithms, uh, auto asset shift. So we can see that from 1.0, they need to do in calling and need to question us and need to give you the bond share list, everything. But 4.0, no need. That's why we give you the, the advices that are more suitable for you, for you personal, especially suitable for you. And you can just straight away saving your time and earn the money, right? No need to wasting time in waiting or everything. So what our fintech is, the, my, the, the best thing is they're trying to make it fast and save the time and make the evaluations and continue uh, to the 5.0. So that's all uh, for my presentations. And thank you for everyone. And thank you for lecturers. Thank you for listening to my presentations. Thank you.